Today's rains having an impact uh, across northern New York as well, of course. NBC5's Benny Nazai joins us live from our studio in Plattsburgh. He's back from Ausable Forks uh, and took a look at conditions there. Yes, Sue. So here in New York, both Essex and Franklin counties have declared state of emergencies due to the flooding happening in both counties. Now, New York State Route 9N from All Sable Forks to the town of Keene has been blocked off due to flooding, and an evacuation notice has been put out for the Jersey and Intervale sections of All Sable Forks. Now, other roads in Essex County have closed, including Hurricane Road and the town of Keene and Water Street in Elizabethtown. Now, earlier, I spoke with the first assistant chief of the All Sable Forks Fire Department, and while he admitted that there's a lot of uncertainty with this storm, the first thing that comes to mind is people's safety. We're playing it by ear right now. I, uh, I can't really tell you what's going to happen. As we all know, we don't know what to expect, but we're preparing as if something bad's going to happen. So we're going to be proactive about it instead of reactive and get ahead of it and make sure everyone's safe. And to uh, very similar to Vermont, various northern New York school districts have closed early due to the storms, including Keene, Bokit Valley and Austable Valley. And while the state of emergencies will remain in effect for the next five days, there is an emergency shelter that has been set up at the town of Jay Community Center.